a lot of the species that depend on snag forest habitat have become rare because of fire suppression, because of post-fire logging, because of all the herbicide spraying um, on the, the, the shrubs where they come in and they want to plant tree plantations. I think for me the point is from an ecological perspective we need to embrace these processes and understand that they're much much older than humanity. These processes go back, they go back tens of millions of years. So there's been this endless cycle of, of, of life and death and rebirth and rejuvenation going on um, for thousands of times longer than humanity has been on this planet. Unfortunately, the Forest Service is opportunistically and cynically using climate change to try to justify logging policies that are damaging the forest and making climate change worse. The typical commercial thinning logging operation emits three times more carbon into the atmosphere than a wildfire alone. Three times more. So what are we doing? It doesn't make any sense from a climate change perspective. And of course, that's making climate change worse, which is influencing fires more. And then they're doing more post-fire logging and more commercial thinning, making climate change worse. And it's an endless cycle. What we need to do is shift direction, start moving away from logging, start reducing our wood consumption, shifting towards reduced consumption and non-wood alternatives for building materials for paper, and focusing our attention and resources on protecting communities from wildfire. Everything they're doing out in the forest is, is making climate change worse. It's damaging wildlife habitat. It's putting communities at greater risk. We found that the more trees you remove from the forest, the hotter and faster fires burn, oftentimes toward towns. The voices of scientists we're hearing out there are basically paid by the Forest Service, including a lot of university scientists. And it doesn't mean they're bad people. It just means that they have a financial conflict of interest and almost no one's talking about it. And we need to talk about it.